hi guys welcome to my channel my name is makeda daniels and today i'm going to talk about my favorite author so let's get to it is his name is ken follett and i really like him i i like his writing i'm going to talk about the century trilogy these are his this is a trilogy about the about world war one two and about the cold war you have fall of titans then you have winter of the world i think winter of then you have winter of the world and then you have edge of the edge of eternity this is the the last one the third one so from the three i liked the the first one and the third one i enjoyed the most the first one let me tell you what the book is about what the trilogy is about the trilogy is about eight families we get to follow eight families during the the during world war one two and um and the cold war we are following eight families we're following this family and see how they are coping with the chaos, with the chaos and all the changes that have that's happening during this time of the war we are following a family from germany from england from scotland america from russia and why i love um can follow it he is he does a splendid job in in his characters when it comes to writing about his characters he does a marvelous job also about the setting it's like you're there at least for me it's like i'm there i can feel these people their 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 joy their their fear and their happiness it's like you're there with them so that's the reason I really like his his writing. I loved for the most for the from the three I like the first one and the third one the most. The third the first one the scene the first scene at it grab it grabs you immediately, especially the first scene where it starts with the coronation of King George the fifth. And it is also the same day that one of the characters, his name is Billy Williams, is from a coal mining family. He's 13 years old and it is his first day at working in the coal mine. And what I liked about the scene is that it gives you an indication what kind of um, society or how can I say it? It's like what expectations there were for children in a family like that because this boy is 13 years old and he was considered to be grown to do a grown man's job in a coal mine where it's very dangerous you can die people were dying almost every week so this boy is 13 years old and he this is his job and he was very excited it's being a coal mining son that was his future so a really great scene i really enjoyed it and this is the last one edge of eternity in dutch it's called out at Austin. this one i also enjoyed very much because it touches the subject about race it also talks about the assassination of Martin Luther King. It talks about the assassination of John F. John F. Kennedy. There is a lot of mistrust going on, a lot of nasty politics. We also get to follow a young man. He's half Russian and half black. We get to follow the story of Martin Luther King through him. I'm not going to say anything more about him because otherwise I'm going to spoil it. So this one is really, really good. I really enjoyed it. So if you like historical fiction and you would like to know more about World War One, Two, and the Cold War, you should, 
I would I would really recommend this the trilogy Sentry trilogy from Can't Fall It. So that was it you guys. I hope you like my video and the next video will also be about Can't Fall It because he's he had another he, he has another trilogy about the, this takes place in the medieval and the third one of that trilogy is coming out on 12th September. So I'm going to get that one and I'll let you know. So, bye!